Thank you for taking the time to learn more about jellyfish. In this video, we would like to go over unpacking as well as key features of this product and how to use it safely in your home. Now, I'm gonna show you how to open your jellyfish fuel gel can. Using a flathead screwdriver, gently break the lid seal. Use caution as contents may build up pressure over time. Take care to prevent accidental spills. In this next part, I'm gonna demonstrate how to light your fuel gel can. Only use jellyfish fireplace and fixtures designed for fuel gel cans. So you place your can in a designated jellyfish fireplace and fixture slot before lighting. Do not use more than four cans in one fixture at the same time. Light using only long fireplace matches or a barbecue style lighter. Do not use a short lighter and do not use small matches. First of all, shake the can well before opening. Keep out of the reach of children. In case of a fire emergency, use a CO2 based fire extinguisher to eliminate the flames. Do not douse water on the fuel gel cans as it will not work. Never move the fuel gel cans while the flame is still burning. And never leave the fuel gel cans unattended. Wait at least 20 to 30 minutes before moving the can after you have extinguished the flames. For more information on safety tips, please refer to the label on the back of the can. Thank you again for learning more about our product. We would like to hear your feedback and comments. Please make sure to follow us on Facebook and LinkedIn. Thank you.